Okay, um, let's talk for a minute. I actually have a list of when I'm about to talk to you guys and it's over at my laptop. Give me a second. Okay, so we're gonna be talking about a quick little recap of my last video before this one. I know it's been a while since I've done any, so what's my excuse? I've been lazy. I've been really, really lazy. I think working and paying bills and maintaining a good, very expensive girlfriend is a, she's over here, is quite overwhelming. So, but there's no, you know, I don't wanna continue with this, that type of lifestyle. I wanna end that and I wanna continue connecting with you guys. And of course, trying to still spread the sport, which is calisthenics and so of course, well, we're gonna make a lot of updates on how I do vlogs in the future. So let's take a quick recap. I've got here a list. Um, number one from my last video of, as you can remember, well, only a few of you watched that. Only a small amount of people watched that video. I uploaded a workout routine during quarantine, during lockdown. And that was like my last video because I've been lazy during the lockdown, losing a lot of you know, losing some of my businesses that I've been planning to release during 2019 was a lot to take. So when I was locked during the lockdown, I just went on full hibernation mode. I just stay on bed, ate a lot of unhealthy foods, and basically took a break a little too far. After that, I tried to make a vlog video, which was the last one. It didn't, well, it was a great workout program, but it wasn't that consistent. After that video, I just still stopped doing what I usually do. But now we're back. I'm gonna try to make some updates on how I do the vlog now. Okay, so story number two, the reason why I got delayed on continuing to make these videos is because I had an accident. I fell on my motorcycle during uh, parking it and I fractured my, my thought. I'm gonna show you a couple of footages over that. and. But now, after four months, I think I'm now quite doing okay. Started working out, started doing some fitness rehabs, and number well, what well, that's it. I mean, just let me put this down. Okay, so basically, the main reason why I haven't uploaded any content for you guys is because I got lazy. That's it. There's no other excuse to it. But now we're gonna make some updates. I'm gonna try to at least release one video per week. It's either going to be on my lifestyle, on the workouts that I'm gonna be doing. So I'm gonna start um, doing that from this video. So right now I'm here in Morocco again for a vacation. So I, I told myself I need a big break also for Valentine's Day. And we're gonna do some workout. I'm gonna bring you guys with me. I'm gonna share this routine that I'm about to hit. Not sure if I can finish it, but I'm gonna do my best. Uh, this is a bit intermediate level, so if you guys are looking for a major hard workout, you can either just adjust the reps for your pace or you can do what I did. So let's go hit the beach. Right now we're walking on our way to the spot here where there is a calisthenics bar. I went here about three years ago, but now I'm gonna go back there and do some routine. Like, I've plugged in an ND filter on my camera. It's on max, but it's like super bright in here. Like at this time, the sun hits the sand really right. And everything's just white. Here, let me show you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna open the ND filter. That's like what we're seeing right now. So let's bring that down. Now, I'm not sure if this was on the same spot three years ago, but if you're in here in there, and you're looking for this, uh, the bar in, in Boracay, it's over here in front of Starbucks. It's right exactly over there. There's a straight bar, it's tied up in a coconut tree, and you can basically do your workouts over there. So, we're here now. So Starbucks is right over here. And there's the bar. So what I'm going to be doing here is 15 muscle ups, 15 pull ups, and 15 dips. That's in one go. So I'm not sure if I can handle that, but we'll see. 
Underestimated the workout too much. <laughs> okay, so I guess, hmm, this is the result of me kind of getting a little bit lazy with everything. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna modify the workout instead of attacking it as a circuit. We're gonna skip in two or three different workouts. So we're gonna finish the, and I also changed the reps. Instead of 15, I went with 10. So, 10 muscle ups, 10 dips, and then 10 pull ups. So that was my first set. I'm gonna finish the last two sets, so let's go. finished my workout and I have to be pretty honest it was hard it was more than I was expecting that's what you get for being so lazy lately um, now I'm having actually doubts and getting my coffee because I don't feel so good you know that feeling when you're first time working out and you feel like you want to puke that's what I'm feeling right now but the workout is great I'm feeling all the pump my physique and uh, yeah might skip coffee and right now, I might just uh, fix myself up, change into some uh, new clothing because I'm full of sweat. And I'm going to hit a place here, probably going to get my lunch over there uh, from a friend of mine. So let's go check it out right now. Well, that was a refreshing workout. So right now, me and Veronica are on our way to a restaurant of my friend here in Morakai. This is one of the places that I really recommend when you guys visit here. It's called Jalicious. It's uh, Indonesian. So it's basically a lot of healthy foods. Uh, normally, I know I'm on a intermittent fasting diet, but since I'm here for a vacation, I think, you know, it's okay to move away from the, from the normal routines. So right now I'm gonna show you a quick tour on, on the way over there. So let's go. So in order to get to Jalicious, you're basically gonna ride one of these e-bikes that I'm riding right now, and you're gonna head, you're gonna have to head onto Station Three or over at Key Hotel, and from there we're gonna take a few walks. I'm gonna show you where the exact location is. And we're gonna go there right now. So we just got down from e-bike, which is that one. Uh, so this is the Key Hotel. We're gonna walk over there, which is over there on the way there so so based on the instructions we're gonna take the right side of the hotel we're gonna walk through all the way to the beach and then uh yo <laughs> that was nice so yeah we're gonna go and we're gonna head straight to the beach 
and we're gonna turn left and basically it's over there. I'm gonna show on the screen the exact location. And I'm pretty sure you can uh, see these, uh, you can see this location on uh, Google Maps. So let's go. Guys, check this out. Here she is. Welcome. <laughs> <laughs> right, so this is a spot. This is what's called delicious. Small store, but they're jam packed with delicious food. So let's have a try. If you guys like spicy and sweet foods, this is a must try, especially if you are in need of a high protein meal, this is a must try. How you eat, a proper way to eat mee goreng. You have to mix everything together. So you add the zest and then you mix the egg with the noodles and you give it a try. And then every bite, you can like nang the Every bite you can have a picture. So do you put it in or you just no, eat no, it? No, 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 you just eat it. Okay. You just have to eat it. And like if you want some like different texture, you can eat the protein along with the with the mee goreng. Okay. Yeah. My protein. Yeah. It's different. I mean it's, mm. it's weird. But Look. I'm just I've never eaten something that tastes like this. So that's yeah, why. yeah. It's like the pancit of Indonesia. Yeah. This is actually great, the mee goreng. Um, you know, as a Filipino, you think if you eat this, it is pancit, of course, you are expecting the flavor to be like the same because it looks the same. But actually, it tastes different, but in a good way. So, if you guys are up for, or if you're into Indonesian food, or if you want to try Indonesian food, delicious is a must try. So that was a refreshing meal from Delicious and uh, Jelly for watching this, thank you for that meal. I'll see you again next time. I'll be make sure to stop by when I come back here in Boracay. Well, I hope you guys understand the reasons why I haven't been so active lately with the vlog and everything, but I hope and my main target is to at least release a video once a week just to get myself updated with everything else that has been going on with my fitness journey and everything like that. So if you like this video, um, share, tag a friend, like, do all of those stuff. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. See ya.